there, food adventurers, and welcome back to Chef Isaiah Sipian. I'm thrilled to have you join me for another mouth-watering culinary journey. Today, we are diving headfirst into a delicious challenge inspired by one of my incredible fans, at Tyler Sello. Comment down below. If you're not already subscribed, hit that button and turn on notifications so you will never miss out on these epic food creations. Now, when a dedicated fan suggests that we take on the Five Guys Classic, the irresistible burger, those legendary fresh Cajun fries, and that iconic peanut butter shake, and make them better, well, you already know I'm all in. So grab your appetite and buckle up, because we're about to elevate these favorites to a whole new level of taste and satisfaction. First things first, we're diving headfirst into Flavor Town by sautéing a tantalizing combination of finely chopped onions and mushrooms in a sizzling pool of butter. You know that sizzle and that aroma, that's where the magic begins. <clears throat> As those glorious vegetables turn golden and fragrant, our burger canvas is ready to be adorned with the perfect touches. We're talking about slicing up some fresh, juicy tomatoes and giving them a sprinkle of salt and pepper. But wait, there's more. We're taking crisp lettuce and giving it the royal treatment. Shredding it into delicate, vibrant ribbons that will add a tantalizing crunch to every mouthful. Now here comes the piece de resistance. The burger patty itself. We're talking about a perfect quarter pound of juicy, flavorful meat rolled into a ball of delicious potential. Now hold on to your spatulas because here's where the real burger ballet happens. We're searing that patty to a perfection in a hot sizzling skillet. And what do we do next? You guessed it. The legendary burger smash. Give it all you got and let that sizzle of awesomeness fill the air. Foot, and now it's time to crown that patty with a blanket of gooey, melty cheese. Ah yes, that kind that dreams are made of. But we're not stopping at just one round of Burger Brilliance. Oh no, my friends. <clears throat> we're doing this twice. Double the smash, double the flavor, and double the yum. Now to seal the deal, let's take those buns, golden delights in their own right, and give them a toast with a rather generous swather of butter. The time has come. <clears throat> it's the grand finale. We stack those layers of flavor from the melty cheese top patty to the fresh tomato slices. The crunchy shredded lettuce and those perfectly sautéed mushrooms and onions. Every layer, every ingredient is a step closer to Burger Nirvana. And there you have it folks, our masterful all the way burger creation. That's not just a meal, but an experience you won't forget. But guess what? We're just getting started on this culinary adventure. Hold on to your aprons, folks, because it's time to unleash the flavor bomb of our legendary Cajun fries. Get ready to experience the irresistible crunch and zesty spice that'll have you craving for more. Now listen up, because we're about to take your fry grain to a whole new level. We're starting with the foundation, those crispy golden fries that'll have you reaching for one after another. So how do we achieve fry perfection, you ask? Well... Grab your mandolin or trusty chef knife and get those potatoes sliced into equal size pieces. Now here's a little secret that's about to elevate your fry game. We're starting by giving our fries a luxurious vinegar bath. Fill a pot with water and add 2-3 to three tablespoons of vinegar and let those fries take a nice warm dip and simmer away for about 10 minutes. Make sure you dry those fries up and now it's time to sizzle things up. We're diving into that hot bubbling oil at 375 degrees. Can you hear that sizzle? That's the sound of crispy perfection in the making. As those fries turn a delicate shade of golden, it's time for their transformation encore. Take them out, 
let them cool to room temperature about 10 minutes and then we're going to be back for round two. This time around we're taking crispiness, the kind that makes your taste buds do a happy dance, to a whole new level. Fry until they're a beautiful brown with an irresistible crisp. And now the moment you've all been waiting for, the grand finale of flavor infusion. We're tossing those fries with a generous sprinkle of salt and pepper, and here comes our homemade Cajun seasoning. Toss and turn, make sure every fry is coated in that irresistible Cajun goodness. The result, a symphony of flavors that will have you reaching for fry after fry, unable to resist the temptation. Now, brace yourself, dessert enthusiast, because it's time to dive into a creamy, dreamy world of peanut butter goodness. Get ready to satisfy your sweet tooth and elevate your shake game to new heights. Alright folks, we're kicking off this divine journey with the key to shake perfection. Room temperature vanilla ice cream. It's a velvety canvas that will create our peanut butter masterpiece. And now for the luscious nutty twist. Enter half a cup of creamy peanut butter. We're going to go ahead and add in two peanut butter cookies of your choice. Now let's bring it all together on a mesmerizing dance of flavors. To the mix, we're pouring in three quarters of a cup of whole milk. And hold on tight because we're going to start blending. Let that mixer work its magic until you're left with a smooth, creamy symphony of vanilla, peanut butter, and cookie delight. <clears throat> Take that creamy peanut butter shake and pour that into your beautiful glass. Go ahead and put on a glove. And if you're like me and you optionally forget to dress the outside of your glass beforehand, go ahead and put that on there now and crush up a peanut butter cookie and decorate the outside of that rim. After you have that decorated, we're going to go ahead and top that all off with a cloud of whipped cream. We're turning up the decadence by sprinkling a handful of crushed peanuts over the whipped cream. And that's going to add a nice little nutty crunch. And we're going to place a whole peanut butter cookie right on top. Go ahead and finish that up with a cherry. And with that all done, before we wrap this epic journey, my friends, it's time for the ultimate moment of truth. The taste test that will seal the deal and crown our creations as nothing short of spectacular. First up, the burger. Sizzling with flavor and love. Mm, you can practically smell that deliciousness. Oh wow, that's a burst of juiciness and perfection. And now, let's talk fries. That crunch is real. These Cajun wonders are crispy, flavorful, and absolutely addictive. It's like a sympathy of textures and spices dancing on your palate. Last but certainly not least, let's indulge in this velvety peanut butter shake. The sweet note to our culinary sympathy. Oh my god, that that's a peanut butter dream in a glass. Creamy, nutty, and delicious. Kinda like my ex-wife. Ladies and gentlemen, if you ask me, this contest, it's not a contest. Well, let's just say we came... We cooked and we conquered. <laughs>